Coming up next, it is our main event of the evening between Connor, Notorious McGregor, and El Diablo. El Diablo set to enter the octagon and take out the champion and lead with the UFC welterweight belt around his waist. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of this cage tonight as the new champion. El Diablo enters the octagon, and he's ready to fight. is one of the most creative and dynamic fighters in the UFC's featherweight division today. He is also one of the most loved fighters to ever come out of Ireland. Conor McGregor, ready to fight tonight here in Las Vegas. For this welterweight championship fight, McGregor is 27, El Diablo is 35. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. And once again, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Pergliata. And now, this is the moment Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Welterweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a monster making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Tokyo, Japan, presenting the challenger, El Diablo. And now introducing the champion, fighting at the red corner. This man is an ex martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC welterweight champion of the world, the notorious Conor McGregor! All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to bring with your hands at all times, protect yourself at all times, and a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. Conor McGregor, Ready? El Ready? Diablo. Let's and go here we go. The welterweight title is on the line. Tonight's main event of the evening is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. His opponent is so much taller than him. Joe, what does he have to do to try to counter that? He's got to figure out how to get inside. He's got to get inside the long range of his opponent, get inside the strikes, and work the body. He lands a head kick. Big 
big straight punch. He hurt him with that hook. Big shot. Nice combination. Beautiful body shot there, too. Oh, what a leg kick. Vicious combination. Nice jab. Good hook from the clinch. Locks in the Muay Thai clinch. The hook blocked by McGregor. He's got over and under here. Tosses him through the air. Beautiful judo throw. He got tagged there. Now made a clean oh, good elbow. elbow. Very nice. Timing with the left hand. He's got a submission. Stay short, stay short. He's looking for the mounted triangle here. And what he wants to do is he wants that's out. Very nicely done. Connected there. He postures into place. He's got half guard. Oh, nice elbow to the body. And he's got he's side, side control. control. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. He's back to side control. Solid punch by El Diablo. Half guard. Escapes. He's out of the full mount. Just over two remain. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. He's got side control. He's got the full mount, Joe. McGregor's looking for the arm. He's got the arm here. Now he's going to throw his leg over. He's got that armbar locked in. Almost had the armbar. Nice work from the body. Oh, look at that. Get that back to his Nice feet. job in the clinch by El Diablo. Knee to the body. Nice job with the roundhouse. McGregor's eyes looking really swollen now. You've got to wonder whether or not it's actually a fractured organ. Delivered that right to the midsection of his opponent. They are exchanging here, Mike. Mixing it up. He anticipates and catches the kick. Final minute of round one. Clean job. Domination by the champion. Nice right by McGregor. Short uppercut. McGregor gets him in the plum. Joey's looking for some control here. He's got double underhooks. They are really battling for position in the clinch. 30 seconds. Good knee by El Diablo. He transitions to the tie clinch. Got double underhooks. Pummels out of double underhooks here. Final seconds. And he hit the flying arm bar. Beautiful. Wow, that was close. Connor McGregor's still alive. Surviving a submission attempt late in that round. That was a very, very close submission attempt at the end of that round. And here we see some beautiful submission offense here. And there's another excellent attempt at the submission, but can't quite finish it. And let's see if we can get a better look at it from a different angle. A lot of really good submission attempts being shown in that round. 
the lovely Brittany getting a set for round number two. Round two. The battle continues, and the champion is being pushed to the brink. The top contender looks very good, very calm, very poised, very determined to leave with the belt. Joe, as you can see from the numbers, he's really looking to finish this fight by submission. Oh, now there's a nice leg kick. There's oh, a big left, left hand. hand. Hard straight punch. Wow! Solid shot to the body. He connects with the head kick. Nice combination. Swing and a miss. Massive inside leg kick. A oh, big kick. They're scoring. Oh, he's got his back. Knee to the leg here, Joe. Joe, everyone in attendance tonight might actually be Irish. Listen to the support for Conor McGregor. Nice right hook to the body by McGregor. They separate. Vicious knee to the body lands. Head kick. Back and forth battle. Big straight punch. Nasty combinations here. Misses with the head kick. Oh, he tagged him. Oh, they, you know what? Now it's really bleeding, Joe. El Diablo is continuing to punish that eye. Yes, he is. That's a good target for him. He sees the swelling, and it's going to impede his opponent's vision. Good slip and counter by McGregor. And he scores a single leg takedown. And in guard. Posture's up. Solid right by McGregor. Hammer fist. Tries to pass, but cannot. Nice work from the bottom by El Diablo. Punch from the bottom. Now his other eye is really swelling. El Diablo's back inside control. Oh, looking for his back. He's got his back here, Joe. Looking for the rear naked choke. He pops out of the rear naked choke. He's working from half guard now. Now he's in full guard. Nice sweep to get to top position. Beautiful hammer fist. Able to pass to half guard. Side control. He's doing a great job of ground and pound here. Ripping to the body and to the head, staying busy.
back to their feet. Final seconds of round number two. No, oh, the left leg goes high. Going to head to round three. I need you to protect this cut. It's getting too bad now. I don't want it to be stopped. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. You can really see how awesome that round was by these highlights. The beautiful Ariani. Are you ready? Are you ready? Third round of this championship fight. El Diablo striking was outstanding that last one. Yes, he landed a high number of significant strikes in that round. Big bombs. Head kick. Nicely done. Try for a head kick here. Oh, nice inside leg kick right there. Looking to finish it. Big shots. Oh, he missed that kick. Oh, big body kick. Rocked him with that right hand. Hard straight punch. The head kick. Vicious kick to the body. Huge kick to the head. That's a big hook. Strong jab. His other eye is starting to swell bad. And there's a takedown. So standing and trading. Exactly what we had hoped for. McGregor continuing to land his strikes. El Diablo with a nice straight left. El Diablo's opponent has to do a much better job at protecting that cut. He certainly is targeting that cut. He's like a shark. He smells blood. And he's trying to open that thing up. Good connection by McGregor. Just missed with a huge kick. They clinch up. Got the Muay Thai clinch. Knees are coming. McGregor with some big knees. Under three now. El Diablo's got him in the plum clinch. He's got the double. Joe, nice knee by McGregor. And pummels under and out of double underhooks. Past the midway point of our championship fight. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Solid hook to the body from the clinch. Nicely done. He gets his back. Very nice sweep winds up in his guard. Under two minutes now. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Beautiful reversal. Excellent sweep. Full mouse. Very nicely done. Oh, man, look at him now. McGregor with the elbow to the head. Big Huge elbow. elbow. Get up, get up. 
Great transition to top position. Solid right hand. Oh, he got reversed. He's back to full mount again. He's got some time to work here, 45 seconds. Oh, he's hurt, that's Hit. it, it's that's over. it. The fight is over. TKO victory. He was not intelligently defending himself, and that's a wrap. Time now for our fight replay. We can see it here on a different angle. There are some big shots getting through here. Vicious ground and pound combination that leads to the TKO. And here we see one more time, big shots unanswered, not defending himself. The referee comes in to save him. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliano calls a stop to this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by TKO, and still the undisputed UFC Walter White champion of the world, the notorious Conor McGregor. Conor Notorious McGregor remains the UFC welterweight champion.